Hi guys, my name is Valerie. I am a part-time reseller and I am here to do an unboxing of some shoes that I got for a pretty low, decent price I would sell that I plan to resell. So I'm a part-time reseller and I've been doing this since last year, August. I do have a full-time job, so I just do this on a part-time basis. Um, I love doing these unboxing videos because when I was looking into doing reselling, I was, a, I was watching a lot of videos and saw a lot of people doing some unboxings and it was helpful to me to see the different places to buy from, the things that I can get and things that I can possibly resell. So today I am doing an unboxing of some shoes. Um, this is not a shoe box, but these are some various shoes that I purchased from the same company that I purchased for a really decent price. I think that I am going to resell on the various platforms that I sell on. I have purchased shoes from them before and have done very well with the shoes. They sell them for a really good price and I've been able to like get really decent money off of the shoes. So let's get started. I have this one right on top because I actually just sold this. So this one is a pair of Sorel. If you're familiar with this, this is a pair of Sorel boots. These are called EV Pull On. And this I brought for $45. This is a size nine and a half. This is the shoe here. There's the sole there. So I brought these for $45 and I just sold these um about an hour ago on Poshmark Poshmark sorry my accent um for $95 so I purchased it for 45 sold it for 95 and I think when I check my portion that I get because you know Poshmark if you're familiar I feel like they take a good chunk in comparison to all the other places like eBay and Macari um I think it was 70 something if I'm not mistaken okay so what is next? So next, oh, this open. Well, let's do this one here. This is another pair of Sorel shoes. These are called um, um, Emily to Chelsea. Um, these are size eight. And this was also $45. This is the shoe right here. It's like a boot. Most of the stuff that I have are like probably well, are pretty much are not for this time of the year but you know I've been posting them anyway um so if they don't sell I know that they will definitely do much better in the winter time um or when it gets cooler so yeah again $45 that's the sole these are all new um this particular place does not sell any used shoes um so $45 um this is already posted as well but it has not sold just yet let me move this since I got to put this in a box to send out tomorrow. Uh, this one fell. I don't know how this happened. Oh. Well, I'll save that for last. I'll save that one for last. This one, I've never heard of these shoes before. And this is the first time I've come across it on with them. And I've never heard of them before Um, and just in regular life. um, It's called, I think it's pronounced Merrill. And so yeah, well, let's see. Where is the name? Yeah. Merrill. Merrill. And they're like um a sneaker. A, um athletic shoe. So these are called Alpine Sneaker. And I think they're so cute. These are size seven. And this is the shoe here. How cute are these? I think they're so cute. Oh, they show better like that when I did it like that. And this is the bottom there so cute i think they're so cute and um these two are also posted um and this was also 45 dollars as well so let me get this other one that somehow flipped oh these here also 45 dollars are a pair of uggs this particular UGG is called, oh, I forgot a small one here. This is the Classic Femme Zip Boot. Classic Femme Zip boop, Boot, and this is a size 10, which is actually my size, but I'm not keeping it because I got something else for me. So this is the boot right here. This is the boot. On this side, you see this is where the zip is. Brand new, sold there, brand new. It's got the, you know, the little fur type stuff inside. 
um, again, $45. $45. These are posted to, and I should have told you the prices that I post them for. Um, because I usually always go less than what it is selling on the actual site. Meaning like the UGG site and the Sorel site and the Merrill site. And usually lower than what it is on Amazon as well. So these UGGs, I said, were called what? The, the Femme. So I think I have these posted for a hundred dollars on the UGG site. They were originally two twenty six, and they had a sale, and they were being sold for one fifty nine. So I posted for a hundred dollars. You know, I'm willing to wiggle a little bit. I try when they're forty five dollars. I want at least to get in pocket at least about. I'd like to get between 70 and 75 in pocket for them. It depends what type of shoe it is, you know, if I'll, how much I'll settle for. But clearly I want more than what I paid for it. Because that's what this is all about, right? All right, so here is another box. That was all in that box. There was actually another shoe in that box that sold already that I don't have, which was a pair of, um, a pair of... Tory Birch um, weather boots was also in their boxes, but that's already sold and went out. Now those Tory boot um, Birch boots were um, were sixty dollars because I guess Tory Birch is you know a little bit more upscale than UGG and Sorel and Merle. Those were sixty dollars that I brought it from the, um, the the company from, and I sold them for um, ninety nine dollars, and I think they are on the site for $129 if I'm not mistaken or maybe more somewhere I have $129 on this paper but um I think that maybe that was probably on eBay not eBay on Amazon for $129 but I think on a Tory Burch site it may have been listed for being sold for more so but I sold the Tory Burch ones for $99 but I, so that's why I don't have those here this was in another box here these this was not um, a really good deal, but I don't know what I was thinking at that time. I think I was thinking that I can probably give these to my son, not realizing how girly they looked in person. So these are a pair of Hey Dudes. And they are the, these are women's shoes. They are the um, Wendy Sparkling Rose Gold. So when I saw them doing the live, I was like, okay, this is a nice soft pink. He looks really good in those colors. He wears Hey Dudes. I was like, I think this would translate to his size um, in men. But when I saw them in person and I saw the glitter on it, I was like, okay, that's not going to work. But I brought these for $45. So the, the bad thing I'm saying about this is that these don't sell for much more than that. And usually when I see a shoe that they are selling, I will hurry up and look them up and see how much they go for on eBay before I decide to buy it for that $45 to make see that I can generate some good money from it. Um, and I don't think I did that with this. Or maybe I did. I think, like I said, the intention was that my son would be able to use them. But they are really glittery and look girly. So these, like I said, these are the, um, these are called the sparkling rose gold wendy sparkling rose gold so you can see the glitter in it and i couldn't see the glitter in it when i watched the thing it just like from here i don't know it just looked like it was a soft pink i didn't realize it was glitter and i didn't pay attention to the name actually so these are women's size nine and these go for about um 59 dollars i think i've seen it actually on different platforms for a little bit less than that for like maybe 52 um 54 ish so selling it for that amount i will just break even and i'm not doing this to just break even but this may be the one shoe that i probably really don't make any decent money from because of the price because of how much it costs and because of um you know i only can sell it so much i do i did just post this one because this is a for now like warmer shoe so i'll hurry and post this one and i posted this for sixty dollars on I think Poshmark for sixty dollars, and I think on eBay and Macari for fifty six or fifty nine, somewhere between there. And the thing is, you know, if somebody wants it, they want it. You know, maybe this particular size is not available on the site or anywhere else. And so, if they want it, they want it. If they want to pay that amount, they'll pay that amount. I have people that see a certain type of shoe that I have, and they want it that bad that they don't even try to haggle with me. They buy it straight out. And then you have people who, which is nothing's wrong with, it, will try to, you know, you know lowball you a little bit or just kind of 
you know, off for a lesser amount, but hey, it is what it is, right? Okay, so this one is called, this is another pair of Sorrel boots. I really like this stuff. I started getting into it because I just brought a pair because they were cute and I didn't realize how well they were going to sell and for how much they were going to sell. So this one is called the Kinetic, um, what's that say? Kinetic Carbu. Now, this is a size nine and a half. This looks small for nine and a half. But this is a nine and a half. So the, and these are women's as well. Women boots. $45 as well. There you go. Here's the other side where you can see the Sorel symbol. I like the bottom of it. Look how cute. And it says Sorel down there. So I haven't posted these yet. I think I said to myself that I post a lot of winter boots and what I don't want to happen is for people to, a lot of people to like them and me to start offering, especially on Macari. I, I'm not a big fan of how Macari does when you offer something because after you offer them a certain price to your likers and then they don't buy it. When you have more likers and new likers and you go to offer it to them, you have to offer it for less than what you offered it for before. So you keep end up going down and down and down. And it's like, okay, nobody's buying it yet. And now I can't even offer it for, you know, what I want to offer it for. Which the trick for that is just to basically take it down and repost it and make it like a new um, item again or a new post. So, like I said, those are 45 um, I haven't researched what these go for just yet, so I don't have a price for those, but those are not posted. So I said I was going to hold off on more, some of the winter stuff now and not post any more of those right now and just wait till a little bit later. Um, I have a small box of some like um, Christmas sweaters and um, I think, yeah, some Christmas Disney Christmas sweaters that I'm also put away that I said, you know what, if I post it too early, people are going to try to lowball me. I'm going to feel like I need to get rid of them and I'm not going to get what I should get for them. So these are also a pair of Sorel. Is these Evie's too? Oh, these are a little different though, because the other ones I sold were Evie's. So this is Evie Lace. $45 also. What size is this? Let me see. This is a nine and a half. And so was that one. And the girl who brought or the person who brought that one was a nine and a half. So she may like these, but they may be too similar for her. But they're lace up. So anyway, they, I think they're cute. Nine and a half. This is the shoe how cute smells so good sometimes when you look at it, it looks like a little looks like it's like messed up or whatever but you know because it's suede you gotta like brush it a certain way and then you don't see it um so yeah it's right here too i know hmm. the other time i saw it like this i kind of moved it over with the um i look right here in the back too hmm interesting but I know when I saw this before I kind of um, brushed it a certain way with like my shirt and it kind of faded some so I don't know but I'll definitely point those out I hope I didn't mess it up even more when I just was rubbing it well we shall see so these are cute I feel like now I keep seeing little things on it I don't know I have to play around with this and see I may have to go a little bit low on this because of those little areas but we'll see but i'll definitely you know let the peeps know and indicate that in my description that that has that issue okay so i have one more box this one just came today i did not get to open this yet uh, so i will get to open this with you Alrighty, where's my, here it is. So this is, um, again, from the same people, which is um, Catch and Deals, um, which you'll see that in my, um, probably the thing anyway, so it's no secret. I say where I got my stuff from. It's on you if whether or not you want to get something from there. Um, so yeah, so let's see. It's not like it's a surprise, because you know, I actually was on the live sale that they did. So I know what I got, but it's like it's different when you see them in person. I feel like it's just as exciting. All righty. So let me turn the page because I have, this is listed on this other one here. So here we have, this is, oh yeah, they did tell me that this one didn't come in its original box. Every now and again, some of the shoes don't come in the original box. 
I usually don't like to get those because you know, I think it kind of like helps the sell when it's new and it's in its original box as opposed to if it's new and it's in a not its original box. But I got this one for whatever reason. I think I think I also was planning to give this to my son if I'm not mistaken. So these are Nikes, it says, Nikes. And these are size women, nine and a half. $45 as well. Oh, these are cute. These are, these are nine and a half. These look little. Oh, these are interesting, the bottoms. So look, so here you go. That's the, oh, and they're called, oh no, the name is not here. And I don't think they probably even said it either. Oh, this is going to be a toughie. So if he can't fit these, I don't know what I'm going to do because I don't know what this is called. But these are cute, so see? And I like the bottom. See, look at that. That's different. I didn't, they didn't show that on the thing, but it's like weird, the bottom. It like kind of seems like little holes, like. So yes, yeah, so that was all, this is $45. Women's nine and a half. I don't know if that's actually going to fit him because he's actually a nine in men, which if I'm not mistaken, a nine in men is a 10 in women. So I don't know how that's going to go. And like I said, these I just opened. So, you know, I don't know what this actually goes for and I haven't posted it yet. Um, next is a pair of Adidas. These are size nine. Also women. Is this thing? Oh, I don't remember. I wonder why I got these. Guess to sell. What are they called? Let's see. These are size nine. These are called um, EQ21 Run. So let me show it like this because then you can see the color. So they're pink. You see Adida. It's nice. $45. 45 bucks. You heard? Yeah. I was seeing it had another name. And right here, a pair of Sorel boots. Um, size 8. These are called um, Sorel Explorer 2 Carnival Cozy. Oh, seen them in person. I'm thinking, oh, I forgot that I got these. These are coyotes. Look at these bad boys, y'all. I like this. This is cute. Oh my God, this is too cute. I want to see right now what this goes for. If I can get this phone over here up and running. This is cute. I really like these. See, they lace up. You see the, where is it? the Sorrel there on the back. It shows better like that. Just out of curiosity, I want to see now. Is there a Oh, here it is. Here it is. Oh, and it's right on the thing, too. Okay. Only one came up for sale. Let's check. Let's filter this out to what's sold. Let's see if anything comes up. So nothing came up for um, ones that have sold. But let's just go back to see what the... um. what the person was selling it for. So these, somebody is selling them. It's, I guess it depends on which color, which size, because it says from $151, $151 and to $204 and some change. So I guess it depends. When I see that, it usually depends on the size and the color and stuff like that. But I think these are really cute. Um, I haven't um, gotten anything like this before, and I think these are really cute. So this looks small. This looks small for a nine. Where's the size thing at? No, I didn't say it was a nine. I said it was an eight. Yeah, so this seems about right. Okay. So that is correct. It's a Mundo for a size eight. Okay. There goes that. And the other thing that was in here that I got was this. Um, let me see if it says here how much... I paid for this. This is, it says, um, it's um, Ulta Beauty, like a makeup thing. Does it say the name on here? Ulta Beauty, Beauty Box Glitz Edition. I got this for $15. And I believe it's eyeshadows and stuff in here. So, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't show you. So this is, this is the box here. See, and it's got some zippers here. So let's see. 
what's inside. I think they said, does it say what it retails for on here? I thought they said it said what it retails for, but I don't know. And it has a list of the different things in there, but she, I can't see it. I can't, I can't see it. But I'm going to show you what's inside. And I'll try to scan it to see what it um, goes for. Okay, so look, this is how it looks. You open it, there's a mirror there. Oh, you see me in the mirror? <laughs> and there looks like this is, I don't know if this is like lip gloss type stuff. Oh, and it op if I'm not mistaken, it opens. Oh, okay, how do you do this? Okay, so it opens over to the side like that. That comes over. There's some more stuff there. So you see there's some, looks like eyeshadows maybe. I don't know if that's eyeshadows or, yeah, I think that's got to be eyeshadows. And some, maybe some blush possibly, or some more shades of eyeshadow, some eyeliner there, some other stuff here. This is a cute little box. I don't think anything else is under here. Yeah. So, yeah, nothing else is under there. So that's that. Let's see. Oh, this is the barcode that's going to be probably hard because that is, um, that's not the one that you can scan on eBay. But maybe I can put the name in really quick because what did I tell you it was called beauty box glitz edition so let's see really quick before we say bye now this little phone here want to act silly I guess it's not happening I'm sorry guys um Yeah, okay, it's not coming up, so I don't know. Maybe I'll try to um, remember to put that in the, oh wait, now it is, so let's see. Um, Ulta. It may not even be um on here. This may not be something that um anybody's selling, so who knows? Okay, I think this may be it. Something's coming up. Okay, so it's coming up. And well, so there's like three right here that people are selling. Um, and it's somebody selling for 29, somebody selling it for 41, and somebody selling it for 39. It seems that it's 41 pieces. Everybody 49 pieces and everybody's description says that so I guess the different things the items that come inside Let's check to see if we can see any um If anything the any of these have sold Okay, and the thing just went blank on me. Okay, never mind forget that. I'm sorry. So yeah, so there you have it These are all the items. I got my little bolos besides the um the Hey Dudes, and I don't know what this um, beauty box thing is going to go for. It just was really reasonable, and I thought it was cute. And sometimes when my daughter um, has um, um, dance, like recitals and stuff like that, they have to wear certain types of lipsticks and eyeshadows and things like that. So if worse comes to worse, this could be something that Mackenzie uses if, she, if you know, we need it to be. So, yeah. So there you have it. Thank you guys so much for coming by and watching this kind of sort of unboxing seeing some of the shoes i got and this makeup kit here um please like my ch my video if you will if you enjoyed it please um subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified for when i post more videos just like this thank you bye